Uh, okay, uh, this one I'm showing you uh, how to uh, do first refactoring uh, using groups. So uh, simply, uh, this one is actually another demo. So this file is actually on our class server. So first one, uh, I will collect a serve uh, curves. So here in utility, I'm going to use scribble. So I write down here and I double click me and I'll just write down first uh, uh, select uh, two curves. So I, I kind of I just enter, and then I will collect, <coughs> and actually I group them like this. I select uh, components, and then I will uh, use a group. And actually, it is uh, grouped together. And then probably next one, actually, um, another one. I just called it, and actually, I probably I just kind of cluster these two. So what I do is I just select this area. And then I will just group it, and then I called it uh, scribble two, and then I put it here, and I called it uh, uh, loft two surfaces, and then probably I kind of deleted, delete the group temporarily, and then I just select, I reselect it, and then I group them, and then a little, bit, and then I believe it moved outside. And the next one is actually using a boundary surface. Actually, this one is actually create a top and bottom one. If you're doing that, uh, I'll use scribble to write down that. Uh, create a bottom and top surface. And then I will group this one. And I will select group. And then finally, uh, what I do here is actually um, uh, we'll scribble again, and then actually here uh, I'm showing that uh, join uh, adjacent surfaces, and here, and then I'll just group them here. So this is our uh, this is uh, our uh, first refactoring using uh, groups and I'll save it as uh, just uh, Juhong Demo uh, 002 uh, uh, using group 001 and then actually after doing this uh, we can uh, create a clusters so here I select them and then simply I use cluster and uh, this one and then I, I rename it so this one I rename uh, uh, select uh, two curves and if you actually click the where the name bar is if you double click it you can go inside and you can actually change later and actually these two uh, components are parameters are actually output and then if you want to go outside simply click here and save close and you can uh, go back to your original file I uh, kind of select uh, or uh, components here uh, love the two surfaces then I'm calling it, I may use cluster and I call it uh, a loft to surfaces. Again, if you hover around, you can see the inside roughly. If you want to go inside and change that, go inside. If you want to go outside, click this box and save and close. And this one, also click it um, and cluster. And now I'm calling it as um, create bottom and top surfaces so this one is our cluster and finally this one uh, I use cluster and then I call it uh, uh, join surfaces so this one is extremely clean uh, it's gonna work like a skeletal code and kind of everything is just uh, so clean here and then this one shows algorithm quite well that we select two curves in one hand we loft uh, and create a lofted surface using two curves and then this one create a bottom and top surface and actually we join them together okay so this is the example uh, and then I will uh, explain uh, about uh, lofted with a closed one option I would I want you to some of you try them okay, so and upload these three codes okay thank you and see you on Thursday